Sunday's cell phone recorded encounter at Davidovich Bakery on Manhattan's Lower East Side between Vic, a black employee. He's not going to serve it, so please leave. Why? And a white customer now identified as Stephanie DeNaro, who went on a racist tirade, now viral. All because DeNaro was asked to wear a mask and refused. Oh, she said, are you not going to serve me because you're a N-word. DeNaro, an avid and vocal Trump supporter, has since doubled down over the last few days on social media. Meanwhile, Vic, who does not want to disclose his last name, kept his cool. Mark Fintz is vice president of the bakery. The lesson of this is there's two different types of very different behavior that you're watching. One of them's a role model. One of them's how you should avoid. It's very clear who the role model is. We spoke with Vic Wednesday, and he still wonders why DeNaro thought it was okay to say those things, especially in front of her children. Our four or five kids were all mixed. And, you know, if they have to hear that from their white mother every day, I don't know what their circumstances is. Excellent question, which is why we decided to make a visit to DeNaro's apartment in the Rutgers public housing development, also on the Lower East Side. What word did you say? I said N-I-G-G-A. Do you still think that's appropriate? I think that I was put in a bad position because of the mask policy. So you, you were or were not aware of the mask policy when you walked into the store? I've been to that location many times, and sometimes the security guards have argued with me about masks. Denora once again defended her use of the N-word. If someone is trying to tell me what to do as an American, I have the right to defend myself. Does that defense include using the N-word? It's not the N-word that I used. It's a form of the N-word that I used, that people of all different um, ethnicities and races use. I'm from a generation that grew up on hip hop and rap music. My children are black. I had children with a black man who uses that word regularly. It's not a racist slur that's being portrayed to be. So you think that makes it okay? I think if a black woman was using that same phrase that I use, nobody would be making a big deal about it. That is clearly not true. We asked DeNaro about her choice of words around her children. Using the form of that word that you used in mm -hmm. front of your children and using the P word that you just used in front of your children, are you okay with that? Or is it okay if their think twice about Is it okay that? if their father does that when he's talking about people he knows? I'm not, I'm not talking to and he's father, black? I'm asking you. It doesn't matter if the children are hearing it. DeNaro's deflections aside, the fact of the matter is, despite her defiance, she claims she now understands the line she crossed. Would you do it again? Would you say it again? Publicly, in the way that you did? No, I wouldn't say it publicly in the way that I did.